Here's the tiny house. It's about 12 feet in height, eight feet in width, and 16 feet in length. Here's the front window. Opens from the inside. Here's the side of the tiny house. This side window does not open. There's a window in the back up top. This window opens from the inside as well. Here's the front door. Another side window. This window does not open. Now for the interior of the tiny house. Here's the dining area. Here's the table. It functions as a table, it also collapses and it extends this lower area right here. There's the shelving units here up front. Here's a water catching system. Feeds in from the top, comes down this drain, down here into down here. There's the filtration system and then there's the water tank this table collapses here's the table collapsed as you can see it extends this lower area there's a storage compartment underneath Pretty spacious. Right here on this side of the tiny house, there is a middle wall partition, which is on wheels. It easily rolls. Here is the bathroom area. This wall pushed. Here it is. There's the shower head, compost toilet, a little shelf area for all your bath, your shower necessities. Here's the window. Again, it does not open. The compost toilet, some more shelving units. The water from the shower falls into this drain here. As you can see, the floors are newly painted. Now to the other side of this wall here is the kitchen area. As you can see, you can push the wall Make space for the kitchen area. These lights are solar powered. Now here's the uh, refrigeration unit. This is solar powered as well. Runs completely on solar. There's your shelving. More shelves. Here's the sink, the kitchen sink. Got some outlets there. 
Here's the window. Again, this window does not open. Here's the ladder to the upper loft area. Easily movable. Take this ladder up to the upper loft area. There you would have your bed. Here's your window. Again, this opens. There's a couple latches and this opens. Here's your storage area for your clothes, etc.